we need to take our health care in our own hands and, and take it very seriously. Many of us basically tend to gravitate to, well, the doctor said this, so I'm mm -hmm. going to do that. You know, I was talking to someone last week in Healthcare Awareness Month, and I was saying you'd be surprised at how many individuals go to the doctor, get a prescription, take it to CVS, Rite Aid, Walgreens, get the prescription filled and just take the medication because the doctor said so without even reading that little fact sheet that the CVS or Walgreens pharmacy will give you to tell you what kind of side effects are there? How does this medication interact with me? Does it change my moods? Does it change my mm -hmm. mental awareness? You know, many people just don't do that. And, you know, oftentimes folks will go or get misdiagnosed because you'll go in and you'll, you'll say the doctor may label something or always oh, just autistic or a little bit of AD and D give mm -hmm. the, give the child a medication and just send them on their way. No, people need to stop and say, let me get a second opinion. Let me get a third opinion. That is your right. You know, many of us, we have health care. Um, and for those who don't, and you may use the state based systems, you have the right to ask questions. You have the right to insist on, I'm not quite sure about that before you just want to pop my child with some medication or pop me with some medication. Let's get tested and find out what's going on. Listen. Right now, who you with? Reese. Reese. Who you with? Right now, who you with?